Man, looking at this background makes me want to grab some ice cream or something. Uh, anyway, this is the Disney Afternoon Collection on Steam. And uh, it's got all the Disney Afternoon games on it, the ones for the NES. You got uh, DuckTales, Chippendale, Tailspin, Darkwing Duck, DuckTales 2, and Chippendale Rescue Rangers 2, which is really cool. It even, even has the uh, Disney Afternoon theme song as the background. It's really cool. Um, I do have all of these games uh, as cartridges, uh, of course, with the exception of DuckTales 2 and Chippendales 2, which I think are some of the more expensive games for the NES. But um, it's really nice that they have this little collection. You can play all these. Um, I've not really played a whole lot of each of these, unfortunately. I never really had them growing up. Uh, but today, we're playing Tailspin. Because of all these games, uh, this is probably the one I have the least amount of exposure of. And there you see, I have the theme song, for Tailspin. Um, I, uh, I want to play this game, and I'm going to beat it. And I've actually played this once before. And I've, uh, I, I tried recording it, and it was so bad that I... I didn't even bother releasing it. I deleted all the footage because it was pretty bad. Because this game is deceptively hard. So uh, what I did was I practiced and I got good at it. And I beat it. I've already beaten it once before off camera. And I'm going to beat it now. Um, now I've already played it. But this time around we're going to try for time attack. Uh, this can actually... You can actually... Um, put your best time in and you see the uh the best times there 16 minutes this game is not very long if you know what to do there's uh, i think seven or eight levels and uh i've seen long plays of it online and it's uh long like 25 minutes 30 minutes long so um we're just gonna play and see uh oh it's off to the side okay uh here we go playing <laughs> Tailspin. We're gonna see what my best time is. Start button. Hey, Becky, what's up? Uh, and uh, blah blah blah. We got a mission, and here you go. We're playing Tailspin. And uh, doesn't doesn't look that bad, does it? It's uh, you know, it's got those appealing graphics and really uh, you know, the kind you expect for like the Disney afternoon stuff. Uh, but it is Capcom who made this, so. Uh, it, yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty rough. In, in fact, I would dare say, I would dare compare this to the flying stages in Cuphead, because there are a lot of similarities. For one thing, you, uh, at first you only get uh, three hits, uh, which you can upgrade. There are upgrades in this game, so you can actually get another hit, which thank God is not a beginner's trap, unlike Cuphead. And uh, you, you only get you only get one shot per screen for now until you upgrade that and uh, thankfully that is pretty easy to get you just got to make sure you, you grab all the loot before before you get scrolled off the screen fortunately you got you got this uh, I I'm probably not doing this uh, ideally for a speed run but it, it's kind of necessary if you want to beat this game because did I mention this game is hard it's pretty hard fortunately I've uh, I've already gone through this and uh, I kind of know what you're supposed to do you just got to be careful because again you only get one bullet and uh, here we are at the first boss who's not that difficult you just gotta you just gotta be down here and sh Oop, you gotta watch that and watch the missiles Oh, shoot. Uh. Uh. Crap. You gotta watch that one bullet that comes after you. And through there. Come on, shoot. There we go. Ah. Uh. Ah, oh, crap. I got, I got stuck. That's alright. Uh, one cool thing about this is, uh, even if you have to start over... The, uh, the crates and everything that you've already picked up, uh, you still have those. So, you don't have to go, you know, spend extra time getting things. You see all the crates there are gone. Um, I do really like this game. And uh, it's, it's mostly because I do like Tailspin. 
It's uh, I, I, it's my favorite of the Disney Afternoon cartoons because it's basically just blue collar Ducktales. If you think about it, it's um, it's the same. It's this pretty much the same premise as Ducktales, except they're they're not rich. They're just they're just regular blue collar folk just trying to make it in the world. And I, I think that makes them a little bit more relatable. Eh. Eh. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I gotta concentrate here. I do like the mechanic of um, being able to turn around like this. There we go, got him. All right. Job well done. So here's all the money I get. But yeah, Tailspin was always my favorite, and um, I don't think it gets the attention it deserves. So, uh, okay, we got uh, 100,000, so we can get the Rapid Shot, which gives us two bullets. Hooray! And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just get that. And uh, now we're... <laughs> We're here on the base on the baseball field because yes, of course we are fighting off. And and here's a bonus stage. These are necessary because they they get you extra money and extra lives, which you will need, especially in some of the later stages. You can see here we're playing as Kit Cloud Kicker on his space croissant. His his. Sp is uh, skyboard, I think it is. And see, there you go. I got an extra life, and uh, I, uh, I don't think there's a way out of this. I think you just gotta wait till the timer goes down, which is again not ideal for a speed run. But this isn't really a speed run. I'm just kind of curious to see how how uh, long it takes me to get through this. And kill all those guys. Just wait for those to explode. Um, this is not even the most ab uh, absurd place that uh, we will go in this game. Uh, you will see that soon enough. And as a matter of fact, um, because I mentioned this game is not very long, uh, I don't know how many parts this is going to be. This might actually be a one-off. But uh, we'll, we'll see. I, I don't usually plan for video links until they happen. I just, I, I just play until I'm done. And here's where that turnaround comes in handy, because when I first played this, I nearly freaked out, and I didn't, I, I didn't think to turn around. Okay, gotta get that crate. Gotta get as many of the crates as possible, because those are, I think, are worth uh, the most. And uh, I got that. Uh, oh, I ain't gonna get those. All right, turn around, get this guy. There we go. Oh yeah, it, it doesn't scroll unless you unless you move forward. Oh crap! Oh crap! Crap! Yeah, and these guys, uh, when they're when they're bouncing like that, you can't hit them. And this is the boss, I think. And it's the that baseball that went down into the ground and made that hole, because of course. Man, this, this music is Mega Man as hell. <laughs> Ma matter of fact, uh, this boss is very Mega Man. Which makes sense, you know, being a Capcom game. Uh, I have a feeling that some assets and ideas were recycled into this game from Mega Man. And there we go, job well done. Another level down. There we go. Got some money. Uh, let's see, we can't afford, uh, the body parts, I believe that's the extra heart. Uh, we can buy extra lives. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of this stuff is really expensive. I will err on the side of caution and buy a continue, which are cheap, by the way. Alright, we're flying, we're actually flying through the, through the clouds this time. Uh, by the way, this is not the only Tailspin game. There's one for the uh, Sega Genesis, which I, I do own the cartridge of. 
and I tried playing it, and I didn't really like it. It, um... It, the, the Sega Genesis game was, uh... Get all the crates. The, the Sega Genesis game, for some reason, is a platformer. It's one of those, and it's one of those um, where the hell do I go platformers? The ones where you know you, it has like branching paths and you gotta collect stuff. And um, and there we go, another bonus stage. Um, and I hate those games. And I, I remember playing it and getting frustrated and just stopping. Uh, yeah, yeah, and it's absurd to me because when you think tailspin, you know the first thing you think of is, you know flying in airplanes because that's what the show was about uh, got some good one-ups there so i don't know what they were thinking with the sega genesis game i don't know if there were any other ones that's only the only other one that i know of but um i, I might pick that one up again just to try it and see maybe uh maybe i'll play that one on here too Might as well play all the games based on uh, my favorite Disney afternoon show. Ah, crap. Now there's an extra one up there, and I might, I'm probably going to end up losing that. Cause, yep, there it is. <laughs> Whoops. That's alright. Watch where you're going. Um, I believe the next stage is the... Is the one where you're like, what? <laughs> Why am I here? Ooh, got some, found some secret stuff. Didn't know those were there. That's good, because again, you're going to need all the money you can get in this game. Because that money is very precious. Give me that. There we go. Uh, uh, the bananas are gone. Whoops. Alright, time for this boss, who's... Uh, a little bit hard, but not too difficult once you know what to do. And that is, you can only shoot them when they combine forces. And then you just gotta dodge their projectiles otherwise. There we go. I was gonna say, can you guys please? <laughs> Trying to do a speed run here. Come on. Speed run. Yeah, man, I, I practiced the hell out of this game. I, I, that, that first run I did, the one I recorded, was not good. I, I there was no way I was going to release that. I, I didn't even, I didn't even finish. I ended up dying. But, I practiced, I got good, and I came back. Because that's what you're supposed to do with these games. As much as I, I would have liked to have just gone in blind, it just, uh, it, it was not happening. So, I just got good. That's what you're supposed to do. This ain't no Game Grumps channel. We're actually good at games here. By we, I mean me. And it's ironic considering the, the name of this channel. Alright, uh, we have enough for another heart, which is good. So, we're going to go ahead and get that. Yay, another heart. And uh, the, the engine, I think, improves maneuverability. This one here uh, is the one you're going to really want, the four, 400,000. I'm not even convinced these guys right here are enemies. I think these are just guys working on this building. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just ruining their day and their hard work.